Hi, welcome in. Found this book at Ross in Sierra Vista. Ross Dress for Less. Prayers and Promises for Depression and Anxiety. Let's see what God says about all this. We're going to go right at the beginning. Oh, let me show you the back. See? When doubts filled my mind, your comfort gave me renewed hope and cheer. Psalm 94, verse 19. And that's Ross Dress for Less right here in Sierra Vista, Arizona. Okay, so let's do the introduction. When life's troubles overwhelm you and you feel yourself slipping into di depression or filled with anxiety, find your peace in God. Take comfort in knowing that he cares deeply for you and he will be with you in your darkest moments. Prayers and Promises for Depression and Anxiety is a topically organized collection that guides you through themes of compassion, confidence, courage, identity, inspiration, purpose, and more. Encouraging scriptures, heartfelt prayers, and prompting questions give you an opportunity to think more deeply about the hope found in God's word. Begin to experience underlying joy and peace as you dwell on the promises of God. Okay, there's a, that's the first one here now. Abandonment. Let's go to God's word. The Lord himself goes before you and will be with you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. Deuteronomy 31 verse 8. The Lord loves justice and fairness. He will never abandon his people. They will be kept safe forever. Psalm 37 verse 28. God makes a home for the lonely. He leads out the prisoners into prosperity. Psalm 68, verse 6. I will not abandon you as orphans. I will come to you. John 14, verse 18. God, you say over and over in your word that you will not leave me. Give me eyes to see you when I feel alone. Let my heart know your nearness when I cry out to you. You never turn away from those who need you. And oh, how I need you. I will cling to the truth that your ever-present help is at hand, especially when I've reached the end of my rope. Today, may the comfort of your presence melt away every fear and lead me into love. Do you truly believe that God will never leave you? 